a herd of cows enjoying a meal at a farm near Kampala. Every bite taken, every move made, goes on record to help keep them safe. I'm using the system of Jaguza. For me, when I started using Jaguza, the things are becoming easier for me. Ugandan farmer Daniel Kisitu is talking about a local agriculture company that aims to help farmers increase productivity using technology. They were stealing our cows. You can't trace it, but now you can at least trace your cow after it has been stolen. It has helped me to know a cow that uh, it has got a disease. Now I can consult a doctor. Daniel's success is exactly what Ronald Katamba had in mind when he created Jaguza, a company that fuses tech into livestock farming. We came up with this technology to help farmers improve their livestock production, strengthen food security, and improve mitigation of climate change. So it's a technology that we use for detecting diseases in animals in the next 48 hours before the disease manifests, tracking animal way about for cattle theft, helping farmers who have to access markets, and also information sharing through our veterinary doctors and extension workers to help farmers improve their productivity. The idea was born out of a personal experience. At just 12 years old, Ronald became an orphan and his own caretaker. I couldn't go back to school. So it was that one day when I said I should start farming and I started rearing rabbits for, for fees to pay me fees to go back to school. But there's that one day when all my rabbit died in one night. I could not know what caused the problem for them to die. So I had to repeat the same thing and then I couldn't go back to school. When my rabbit died, the first thing I thought was, how many people are having a challenge like me? So I had to make sure I go back to school, I study. My third year, I thought of developing a technology that will diagnose disease in the next 48 hours before the disease manifests. So that was the birth of Jaguza. And today, the platform is helping farmers around the world avoid the problem of Ronald's rabbits. Our technology is now used in four countries. That is Uganda, Mozambique, Namibia, and, uh, and Fiji. But we also have countries that have invited us country like South Africa in Western Cape Town, Swaziland, and then also Gambia. We are going to make sure we, we roll out to take Jaguza in those countries. The good thing with this device is it's solar powered. So that means a farmer has no problem to charge it. The moment you install it on a cow's ear, that means it's going to be there, it recharge itself. So the moment it, there's any abnormality on the cow, it sends it to the radar which is solar powered also. There's even an option for farmers without internet. We don't